gone in a bunch we of times and visited people. We heard a group was going to be there. We knew a few of them. And we drove in and never found any. Yeah. yeah. At the entrance, it's particularly wide. Right. That's Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. But but it's kind of colorful, too. Yeah. I see yeah. that yeah. one spot there that's got an escape B sign on it. Right. Up on, what is it, Ten or something? County, County Line Road. Somebody put a, a sticker up there. I didn't see any escapees. Well, there's nobody there. It's no. a nice level spot. Yeah, there's Parking. lots of level spots. And it was clean. Yeah, that part of it's clean. Looks like all the slabs, though, have been taken over by uh, people who don't, don't want to camp next to it. Permanent, re <laughs> permanent residents. Yeah. And they're pretty rough. Yeah. Pretty rough looking. They, yeah. Some of them built permanent structures there now. One guy put up a pool, one of those doughboy pools. <laughs> probably, uh, I don't know, 15 foot, I think 3 foot deep and 15 feet across. Because his kids, the school bus comes there and picks up the kids, takes them into Calvary uh. Patrick to go to school. Uh. And the place is, like I said, it's an icon. There's no other place like it. water with a 50, 255 gallon drums and and then uh, and that's another thing you can get water delivered to your rig uh, <laughs> yeah, didn't know that. you can rent you, you pay a uh, $35 deposit on this tower that they come and they put a box wooden 2 by 4 frame about this high and then the, then the, the uh, what was it 55, 60 gallons 60 gallon container, maybe 75. And if they put it right next to your rig, and then you call him up, and he comes and fills it up, oh. up and then you need it. Huh. For an entrepreneur for anything. Yeah. 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 They had a lot. They had a lot of them there by the Lowe's, right there by you. Huh. Those, all those tanks, those uh, corrugated tanks that were. Uh, built. Where'd you dump? At the. Uh, they have a, the Chamber of Commerce has a five dollar dump. And I believe that about 90% of the people just dig a hole in the ground beside their rig and dump in the hole. <laughs> oh, a gopher hole. Yeah, it's, yeah. but it, I saw them do it. They, they hire some of the homeless people there to dig pits. Oh. <laughs> about that, well, about five foot by five foot by five. And then they just run their hose out of their rig. And they went to the trouble. I watched some of them do it. They went to the hardware store, they got a piece of plywood to cover over it, and they, they bored a hole in it and put a sewer fixture on it, and then they just run their hose into the, and then they capped it off when they were, when they were, A lot of times people will do that, and then they actually put, you know, put a layer of dirt on it, and you don't That's get any did. fumes up, and it yeah. does biodegrade, and it doesn't. And while I was there, some guy with a motorhome decided to do a Yui. <laughs> and, he, and he did a Yui right there, and he hit one of those half, you know how heavy, these rigs are, and he hit it with his dualies, and he went right in it. Oh, did that was well? It was odorifus. It was, oh. to say the least. Probably did some damage to the rig too. Yeah. That's what I make blue boys for. Yeah, that's true too. Rolled in a long time. But that rose are pretty rough dragging those. You need to carry them. <laughs> we we got a rack built when we were doing the blue boy that just went in the receiver on the pickup we had at that time and it tilted so you rolled the blue boy up you couldn't lift it so you just pushed down on it and put a pin in and then right up, pin it down. And you could drive off we did that one year i think we paid 25 dollars to get it welded up after steve told the guy what he wanted worked good but you stopped doing that yeah we just take the motor home and go pay the dump yeah. fee and get some water. Yeah. That needs to be run every 10 days anyway. Yeah, every two weeks. Yeah. We've only got a 30 gallon black water tank on that. Really? It's crazy You're the way they engineered some yeah, of these Yeah, we, we never fill the gray big. water <laughs> one. Yeah, well that's... What year is that? 93, probably built in 92. It, he's elderly. 
so were we. <laughs> how many? Fre how much fresh water? Eighty. Huh. That's a little out of proportion. But yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Cheaper this way, we can do it cheaper that way. I'll never tell. He's gathering in. He's gathering information for uh, blackmail. <laughs> well, he hasn't come out, has he? No, he ain't jumped out the window. And he shut up. And he'd be quiet. <laughs> 